Hello and welcome to Celebrity Trends. If it's your first time, please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell for more amazing news on your favorite celebrities. Tyson Fury achieved a split decision victory over Francis Nanyu in their recent bout, although it was surrounded by controversies. Many figures in the boxing and MMA world have raised questions about Fury's tactics and whether he used questionable methods to win. It's worth noting that Francis hit Tyson so hard in the sixth round that he turned into a Muay Thai fighter. The punch was powerful, but it resembled a hook to the back of the head. Other than that, Tyson didn't manage to land significant blows on Francis. However, Fury's claim about his victory with a straight face raises doubts. Israel Adner humorously referred to Tyson's a gypsy elbow move and suggested it played a role in his win over Nanyu. Adisa also noted that Fury landed sneaky blow similar to a gypsy elbow. Tommy Fury, Tyson's brother, expressed his thoughts on the controversial victory, acknowledging his admiration for Tyson's ability to get up from the canvas and still win, highlighting his champion spirit. He also gave credit to Francis Nanyu, recognizing him as a difficult opponent to box against. The combat sports world had mixed reactions to Tyson Fury's controversial victory, with some questioning his tactics, while others praised his resilience and champion spirit. The controversies surrounding Fury's victory include allegations of illegal moves, specifically a blow deemed as an illegal elbow strike on Nanyu. This move typically results in a point deduction, which could have influenced the outcome if one had occurred. Moreover, despite the majority of fight experts and fellow boxers scoring the match in favor of Nanyu, the judges awarded the decision to Fury. This raises concerns regarding the integrity of the scoring. The elbow-shoving controversy might not be widely known to those who haven't closely followed the bout. In the final moments of the fight, Tyson Fury delivered a deliberate elbow strike to Francis Nanyu, which went unnoticed by the referee. Many fans believe that this action warranted a point deduction, or even a disqualification, as it was evident that Fury had violated the rules. Fury's elbow strike appeared obvious to those who closely observed the fight, and it's unclear why the referee did not intervene immediately. However, it can be argued that Fury resorted to this move out of frustration as he appeared to be outmatched throughout the fight. Fury's physical condition was also a cause for concern, as he had gained significant weight since his last fight, indicating possible negligence in his preparation. Furthermore, Fury has a history of pushing the boundaries when it comes to adhering to the rules in his fights, which includes actions such as shoving, throwing low blows, and excessive leaning on his opponents. Some critics believe that referees have allowed these infractions to occur without intervention in Fury's previous fights suggesting a potential bias. Former boxer-turned-trainer Robert Garcia expressed disappointment with Fury's actions, questioning whether the referee observed these fouls in real time. Garcia agreed with the widespread belief that Francis Nanyu had won the fight, emphasizing the lack of apparent damage inflicted by Fury. He also raised questions about the referee's decisions not to penalize Fury for his tactics. Tyson Fury denied any allegations of illegal moves made against him, attributing the uproar surrounding the fight to the disappointment of fans and critics without substantial evidence. Fury recognized Francis Nanyu as a skilled fighter who gave him a tough fight and acknowledged that every boxer has off days. He stressed the importance of moving forward and looking to the future, with the determination to deliver the biggest fight of their generation. Despite the controversies and disappointments surrounding the fight, Francis Nanyu acknowledged the fight as a valuable experience in his first time stepping into the boxing ring. He accepted the split decision victory in favor of Tyson Fury and expressed the desire to improve and convince people of his capabilities in future fights. The MMA community, including Israel Adesagna, shared their thoughts on the fight with Adna characterizing it as a robbery and expressing dissatisfaction with the way the fight was conducted and concluded. Thanks for watching. Till next time on Celebrity Trends.